y'all and welcome back to my channel. I'm Emma Nicole and this week I'm sharing with you nine cleaning products that you should always have in your house. So let's get started. I know y'all are not used to seeing me with dark lipstick, but this is the new Selena color. I believe it's called Big Bertha, but I wanted to try them all on because I just got them this week. So I'm super excited about them. Don't be alarmed. So all the things I'm about to show you are all the products that I always have stocked in the house. They always come in handy. So anyways, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get started. I feel like a whole brand new bitch. So for my first product that I'm gonna show you, if you are a mom and if you have a toddler, these will come in handy 110%. Always have Mr. Clean Magic Erasers. I like the four times stronger ones because Addie likes to think of the world as her canvas and she just colors on everything, the walls, the fridge, the dishwasher. And yes, I correct her and tell her, no, don't do that. But you know how they are, they just kind of get by you and do it anyways. Highly recommend always having magic erasers on hand because they get it out just like that. You do not have to sit there and scrub forever. And even if you don't have kids, these work great on stains, on scuffs, on anything that you can think of that you have a hard time getting out. Try these bad boys out and I promise it'll help. Now please enjoy these short clips of all the places my daughter loves to color. And I really don't understand, she has paper, she has coloring books, she has so many places where she is allowed to color, but this is where she picks and it's just so much fun cleaning it up every week. My next product is the Pledge Antibacterial Multi-Surface Cleaner. I have lots of wood decor. Our dining room table is made out of wood. Our entertainment center is made out of wood. All of the furniture in our bedrooms is wood. So this stuff right here makes it just shine and look super nice and awesome. It is multi-surface. The TVs, the electronics, I use this and it works great and it smells delicious. And it kills 99% of bacteria, so there we go. During this whole drama, this is perfect. Highly, highly recommend always having this stuff in your house. I just wanted to show y'all how I use this and I just spray everything with it and then I just wipe it all down. It just makes my life so much easier because I'm not having to use a million things to clean. All I use is this and the job is done. Fiber cloths. I love cleaning with micro. My, <laughs> I love cleaning with microfiber cloths. They work really well, and I use them to clean the counters, the mirrors, the windows, the coffee table, the all the pieces of furniture. I use the microfiber cloths, and I reuse them, so I'm not wasting all these paper towels. I got these in a big pack at I believe Bed Bath and Beyond. You can get them there. You can get them at TJ Maxx or Marshalls. If you look on Amazon, I'm sure you could find packs of these. Highly recommend always cleaning with microfiber cloths. The next thing that you should always have in your house is a Swiffer duster. I didn't always use Swiffer products. I don't use a Swiffer cleaner because I heard that in the cleaning solution for the Swiffers, um, it's actually bad for your dogs. So if you use a Swiffer and you have a dog, uh, just be careful with that. I hear that it's just not good for them, but what the fuck do I know? I'm not a vet. So anyways, I needed to clean the fan not too long ago, and I was like, I am not using like paper towels or anything. So I was like, I'm gonna try out one of these super dusters, and let me tell you, it worked phenomenally. And I use it to dust the walls, dust all the picture frames, 
and dust all the things that I can't reach. And I used it to dust all the things that I can't reach and it was not expensive at all. So I highly recommend always having one of these in your house because it just makes life so much easier. My fifth cleaning product I'm gonna share with you and you should always have in your house is Baking soda. You can find so many cleaning packs with baking soda online. I think it should just always be something you have under your kitchen sink. You can also put these bad boys in the fridge and it makes your fridge not smelly. There are just so many uses for baking soda. So definitely always have baking soda on hand. If you're trying to clean something difficult and you need help, go online i bet you anything there's a recipe for baking soda and it will save your life that leads me to my next favorite cleaning product that goes hand in hand with the baking soda is distilled white vinegar you should always always have vinegar on hand too because there are so many things that you can clean with vinegar just by itself but also vinegar and baking soda it's like the perfect combo. Just like the baking soda, you can find so many recipes online for vinegar and baking soda or vinegar or whatever. But yes, I use vinegar for many, many things. So I highly recommend it being one of your top things to always keep in your house. Just wanted to show you a small example of what I use my vinegar for every single week and that is to clean my makeup brushes. If it's not the dog, it's the maintenance people. I just can't win. The next thing I recommend that you should always have in your house is an extra spray bottle. I use this for mostly vinegar when I'm like cleaning the oven or if I'm using it to clean the windows. And that's it, call it a day. My life is easy, end of story. Now the last thing I recommend always having in your home, I don't have it because I have not found it here, but I remember how well it worked when I lived back with my mom and it was a must have all the time is a bar of Zote. My mom used to use this to get out stains. When I worked, I used to wear ties for work and I used to use the Zote to clean off the ties and it would work like a charm. I've seen so many hacks with the Zote bar and I'm just like, oh my god, like I wish I could find some here and I have not found any. Normally you can find it at like the dollar store or places like that, but I there's no dollar store here in Hawaii and I have yet to see a bar of Zote anywhere that I've looked and it's very disappointing. Highly recommend you all going out and looking for a bar of Zote because it is the best stain remover and I hear you can also clean your makeup brushes on it. Best believe when I move to Colorado and I can't find it in Colorado, I will drive the eight hours to El Paso just to stock up on my Zote bars. I hope we covered everything. Oh, I forgot one. Just kidding, this is the last cleaning thing you must have in your house. A mini vacuum. This little mini vacuum was only like 20 to 25 bucks at the PX. And it's literally such, such, such a lifesaver. We have a dog and she sheds like crazy and when you are doing your daily cleanup, this little sucker works great. Even if you don't have a dog, but you have kids, it works so well. It is a Bissell Featherweight Vacuum. I could be sweeping all day, every day, but I don't because this thing just does the work for me and best $20 I ever spent. Yes, that was the last cleaning product I recommend buying. But I just heard my baby, so there she is again. I am going to head out. That's the end of my video. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to get notified every time I upload a video. If you have any cleaning must-haves, please drop them in the comments below because I love finding out about new cleaning hacks or cleaning products. So please, please, please tell me, or you can reach out to me on Instagram at Amber Sorbet. But thanks so much for watching. I hope you all are staying home and staying healthy and staying positive. And hopefully, fingers crossed that everything goes back to normal and everybody is healthy and 
we're not dealing with this anymore. But I'll see y'all next week. Bye.